Hi, my name is Dr. Robert Abiati of Island Paradise Dental, and today we're here to talk about can implants damage my other teeth? And I wouldn't say that dental implants damage other teeth. It's that normally, if you have a dental implant up against a natural tooth, and that tooth has weakness, the implant is usually stronger than that tooth that has, let's say, an old mercury or amalgam filling in it, or a breaking down uh, composite filling, or maybe even an older crown that is now breaking down and not in great shape. And why is that? You have to understand what an implant is. An implant is a piece of titanium, a screw that is embedded in your jaw. And then there's an abutment, which is usually made out of titanium, and then a crown that goes over it, made of zirconia or some other type of dental material. All of those materials are tremendously strong. They are much stronger than your natural teeth in certain circumstances. And that being said, if there's weakness on the opposing tooth, that's when patients have problems with dental implants. But that can also happen with a traditional crown. If we put in brand new crowns in an area, let's say the lower left jaw, we go in there and we do a, a, a rehab of that area and place numerous crowns and the teeth above it have very old 30, 40 year old restorations that haven't been repaired in many, 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 many years and there's active decay on them or fractures because the teeth are starting to break. If you put new solid dentistry, crowns, implants up against those, you can then break the opposing dentition just because of the fact that those teeth are already weak. Patients find that, let's say they go eat a lot of hard foods, okay, and they have their brand new crowns or brand new implants placed. Those implants are really going through that food with ease. It can, you can eat nuts, you can eat hard candies, but it's the opposing teeth that have the weakness that typically end up breaking. And that's the issue. So it's very important to understand, it's not the implant or the crown that is actually breaking your opposing teeth, it's that the opposing teeth are already weak.